when will the LCS start having a live audience again? Want to come and see you play? I... I have no clue. I don't know. I, I feel like at some point during quarantine, actually it hasn't really been looking that great. Like the numbers never really started slowing down here. And then at one point here in LA, uh, the restaurants and cafes and everything opened up a little bit and now they've all closed again. So yeah, it's probably going to take a while before we can play in the studio again. What are your thoughts on the new champion? I'm really excited about Lilia. Uh, th this champion looks super cool. I'm, I'm really, really excited to try her out. Um, she looks really nice, um, has some pretty interesting abilities. And I mean, generally speaking, whenever a champ comes out, it's always exciting. What do you think about Mad Lions? Mad Lions have been looking pretty dominant over in Europe. They've been looking pretty good. I've been uh, pleasantly surprised about both Rogue and Mad Lions. Both of them have been consistently performing really well and they're looking very, very strong. Whereas both G2 and Fnatic have had a little bit of a, a rough, rough start to say the least. Okay, so, Volibear. We are gonna start Honda's Machete, Refillable Potion and uh, Trinket Wards. Jungling against Wukong should be a pretty good jungle match for us. This is kind of... Hmm. Twisted Fate. Mid top. Oh, hello there. Nice to meet you. <gasps> um. 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 The Camille trade was fine and all, but... Oh, God. This level 1 is looking rough. Oh, no, no, no. Please don't die. Just run. <laughs> oh, bot lane burned all their summoners against Callista Pantheon. I will definitely be pathing back down to a spot side here. These two are gonna be in trouble. Wait, are they getting dove? No way, right? What? They actually did get dove? No, no, no. Waiting for Echo. Oh, the binding! Let's go! We're back. Top lane got a solo kill as well. We're popping. That was great. Bot lane looked a little rough, but hey, we had a good com comeback play. <laughs> Wait. Um, maybe she is in a pretty rough spot after all. Maybe she's just baiting. Run, Morgana! Run! No, Morgana, no! What? An early game. This game is pretty... This game is pretty action-packed, that's for sure. Just gonna be pathing top to bot here. Top wave is pushing into tier, and he should have a Warden River, so I'm not gonna be able to gank him. I'm kinda scared of our bot lane getting dove again if I don't help them. This guy is gonna consist it. Oh god, we need our mid laners to participate in this one or we're in trouble. The Pantheon? Nope. Uh, Echo wasn't so happy about moving, unfortunately. That kind of sucks. I'm with mid here. No flash, no E. Let's get him. Boom! The big and scary body bears here, let's go! Boom! Goodbye. Now one of the things that I dislike the most about body bear is the cooldown on this ult. Look at my ult cooldown. 160 seconds. That is ridiculous. And it, it kind of makes sense that the, the cooldown on the ult is this long because it is a pretty, pretty strong spell. Pretty crazy how much it provides you. Especially the fact that you can disable turrets with it, that is, that could easily be abused if the cooldown was shorter. But at the same time, playing Volibear and having such a long cooldown on all this, <laughs> slightly annoying. Uh, let's play for Herald here. They already secured Drake and Vukong. Okay, Vukong got Herald as well. Just ran straight from Drake to Herald. Mid laner got one shot. Might be able to kill. Ooh. Okay, 
there's a few too many people here. I think I'm dead. Yeah, there's some conflict. I should have respected more. This Pantheon is just roaming around, killing people. Okay, let's uh, secure the Blood River here. They have vision. I want to take over. Wukong can't fight me. It's impossible for him. I'm way too tanky now. Mm. Not that easy to force. Oh, yeah. No, mind. Wukong helps us force. That works. Double TP or what? Sure that was a double TP. This game is kind of weird. Mm. I felt so strong the entire game, but I just didn't really feel like we're able to do much. Not bad. Uh. Oh my god, that killed me! Didn't even get my ult off. Poor enemy team has so much pressure this game. So much pressure. Drake is still off. This Drake would be really huge. I would love a Mons and Drake. Don't wanna let them continue to stack Drake's either. That would kind of suck. Let's kill bots. We might get Drake over it, but we have to kill first. In order to be able to contest. Why do they have to be a man up? Are we getting top tower at least? Yeah, at least we get top tower. That was kind of a shame. Broxa is volley set the next generation of the Johnny Trundle. Well, that's a pretty good way of looking at this. Uh, yeah! <laughs> Need to check this Herald. Yeah. Got it. I couldn't tell you, Pantheon. Wasn't able to get my heal off. Wait. Echo? Why don't you take the eye? That's so troll. If you wanna int, just take the eye at least. He died with flash up, all up. And he just walked right next to the eye without picking it up. Well, looks like we got a bit of a close game on our hands. A very close one. Feels kinda hard to carry this game. A lot of random stuff going on. A lot of hints. I'm gonna hold in a moment. There we go. Kill the Wukong. Okay, we got him. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Fergan Drake. That's gonna be the next objective to play for. I'm gonna have to base here quick, otherwise, I won't make it in time for Drake. If you can avoid it, always deny. Especially Ocean Soul. The soul is so busted. One problem I got with our team comp is that we have way too many supportive champions. I'm playing a tank, our bot lane is playing double support, and we don't really have a real carry in that sense. Camille is sort of a carry, but not really. Like, we, we kind of need a hyper carry with this comp. Or, like, you know, I mean, I'm not sure if you know about, about this word, but that, that's something I. I've, I've tried to play with it a couple of times, it's called an, it's called an AD carry, like having an AD carry usually feels pretty pretty decent. This bot lane probably should uh, try to read a bit about what an AD carry is, this, this bot lane duo is not my favorite, that's for sure. We actually can't fight that, I don't know. We just have zero damage. What's the purpose of this bot lane? I don't get it. Please don't let them burn. If they get burned, we're doomed. Move! 
Move faster. 3k. Echo in this. But why don't they move earlier? Can you please move to the Baron earlier? What is this? What are you doing? It's just kind of a shame how this game has gone really. I, don't know. I had a really good early game. Pressure so much more than Vukum, but we just didn't do anything with it somehow. I guess we can do what? I was about to say what is she doing, but looks like she might actually be going for a nice play here. Run Camille. Please don't die. But why did you walk back? Why didn't you just keep running? I'm so confused. If she kept running, she would live. Maybe we can still win. I'm pretty strong in this fight. Okay. Because this fight is going to decide the game. Fighting the soul. Oh. Saving my Q for the middle, there we go, stunned. Nice. Not sure if this build is ideal, honestly. I don't think I should go pro first, don't play them frozen hard. It's like kinda either or. Baron is the next objective to play for. Still not sure if we can actually team fight. The answer is probably not. Oh, we need help, we need help, we need help. If Kimmel dies, we're in trouble. Not a bad engage. Triumph. Ooh. Saved by Triumph. Not even close. Should be pretty straightforward from here. Oh, we're actually acing them. I guess our comp is online after all. The double support team comp. Wait, our Camille just died. That was gonna be our main Baron damage. Why is Morgana not helping us? Oh, now she's coming back. Oh, she went to get mana. I guess that makes sense. I thought she would have wanted to defend our base. Yikes, yikes, yikes. This is not good, guys. We're in big, big trouble. I couldn't spite. Oh my god, I had like a millisecond to spite. Oh, oh my god. It's lost! I can't believe it! Are you kidding me? No, I had like a millisecond to smite before I died. I didn't think they could kill me in time. I was like... I wanted to make sure I hit it in the right timing and then I just died. Oh my god, we actually lose like this? Oh no! Camille, why did you have to die? We would have won for free! Oh, comp was online! No!